this is official Setius Industries PC. <laughs> and yeah, I put the sticker on it um, because I just uh, had a chance to actually uh, make a few of them. These are actually uh, proper stickers. And so I thought I'll just uh, put one of these on the PC and uh, make it official. So uh, it's looks pretty awesome, badass now with this. That's just the logo I'm using. So if you don't know, that's uh, what it is. And uh, no, that's not the uh, Devil uh, Worshippers logo. If you don't know that, then just look it up what pentagram means. I mean, if you think that's the devil symbol, then no offense, but then you're just uh, stupid. But anyway. I'll just uh, show the PC real quick, what I have in there. I have the CPU is FX8350. Uh, That's an 8-core CPU running at uh, 4.1 gigahertz with uh, Corsair H100 uh, liquid cooling. Uh, the radiator is behind the back fans in there. And there are actually four fans. I have a push-pull style, one fan in here, then it's radiator and other fans on the back, so it's uh, four fans. That's a custom mod in here. I cut the hole in here and put a fan in here, so it uh, feeds some uh, fresh air for the graphics card, which is, uh, I don't know how well you can see from here, but it's a um, Gainward GTX 680 Phantom Edition. It has two fans in there, it runs pretty cool. The RAM is uh, Corsair Vengeance, 1600 MHz and it's 16 GB, that's more than enough. Uh, motherboard is Asus Crosshair 5 Formula Z, which is one of the best AMD motherboards you can get. Uh, there you can see the pipes going in there. Uh, power supply you can't really see in there, but it's a 600 watts um, OCZ uh, mod extreme. Uh, it's pretty good power supply, it supports SLI by default. Case is uh, Antec TF85. I have a Samsung SSD in here, 250 gigabytes. That's a free terabyte external hard drive, USB free, extremely fast. It's about 220 megabytes per second read and write, so it's pretty cool. And what we have in here, behind these, is uh, two terabyte hard drives. So it's uh, four terabytes of space. These uh, the hard drives, one of them is for just the general stuff, and other one is for games. And I'll just show you the inside of the PC a little bit. There's the RAM, there's the stuff. And yeah, I also have this thing in here, which is a fan controller. I'll put all the links in the description, I have a lot of reviews of this stuff, including this uh, fan controller, which is uh, amazing stuff, that's uh, AeroCool Strike X. Uh, it's pretty awesome, it's a uh, touch screen. Just uh, click on it, unlock it, lock it, I'm not going to touch it right now, because my fans are as they are. But yeah, that's, uh, that's the official PC, so now you have seen it. Also have some lights in there. There's uh, one of the LEDs in there, and I have another one in here that actually changes colors. So I'm gonna just demonstrate. Will it's like green, blue? Looks like purple <laughs> on the webcam, to be honest. But yeah, I have just a small controller for it. So if I just press it, it's white. You can see it better. But I, I know I like to keep it in red. It looks badass and from distance just change the colors I oh, know I like red and rest of it will have a 27 inch monitor that's an IPS monitor you can see the webcam in here Ooh. the other one is 24 inch Samsung that's an Acer one didn't mention it uh, it's pretty cool design that's the headset stuff that's uh, G930 G930 headset that's what I meant that's a cyborg, uh, cyborg, uh, what was it, cyborg V7 keyboard, yes, V7, already forgot. And here we have a cyborg rat 7 mouse, which is the best mouse ever. And it's because of the shape, you can adjust the shape, it's really amazing. I have a review somewhere in the description, so uh, you can check it from there. It's really uh, awesome, the shape, how they made it, that you can adjust it, you can adjust the uh, sides, everything, so it's just awesome. 
Ireland Leap Motion in here. It's uh, not active at the moment, but if you don't know where it is, again, preview is in the description and you can check it from there. That's for games. That's an uh, Razer Onsa 360 TE uh, controller. TE stands for Tournament Edition, which has these uh, extra buttons in here, which are programmable. You can program it uh, using these buttons in here. That's a pretty awesome controller. I like it. And it is recognized as 360 controller, so most of the games support this controller. And that's the reason why I got it. But yeah, so much of the main PC. I've got also 7.1 speaker system. You see the stereo ones in there, and uh, I'm not going to show the other ones. That's just a quick review of the official PC. <laughs> Made it official with the sticker, so. <laughs> I know that's just a uh, pretty random video, but they look pretty cool to be honest. That's for my uh, other uh, YouTube channel actually, what I'm using, the logo, the same thing. So I could put it on like some other PC. It's actually a see-through, so I was actually thinking putting it uh, in here. If you take the sticker off, it's more transparent, but it will block the nice view in there, so I just thought I'd leave it in there. And here's also the speaker controller and something I didn't show, that's a digital microscope. Also pretty uh, cool gadget. But yeah, I'm not going to show my uh, other PC stuff, that's just the uh, main PC what I have in here. So I also have the full specs in the description if you want to look down there somewhere in the description. So check it from there.